Welcome back to The Contact Coach. Please support the channel and take one second to subscribe in the bottom right side of this video. In this video, I'm going to look at Fiji's key attacking moments against Georgia. Now, what makes this really special is this is after 29 positive cases, three cancelled matches, and they go out and put a performance in like this. Imagine what they could do with the support of World Rugby and the unions. This is really cool to watch. Awesome team tries, great skill level. So let's break this down. And after you've watched this video, head over to worldrugbyshop.com for all your equipment and apparel needs. worldrugbyshop.com So it didn't take long Fiji get into the game, less than a minute. Brilliant scrum platform, that's the best place to attack. And they keep it really simple. We've got Tuasova, a 110kg winger, and he is targeting the Georgian midfield. Attack is all about momentum. Look at the leg drive here from Tuisova, also the support from number 12, Botia and number seven, Canavula, just produces really, really quick ball. And Georgia tried desperately to slow it down, but they just didn't get a chance with the pure momentum that was created from that first carry. And now we've got number eight, Tuisu, coming around the corner again on the front foot. So really quick ball. The Georgians cannot get set. Now the next play, you've got Ranradra running hard. Now it wasn't quite accurate enough, but it spills out and it goes to Nandolo. And a lot has got to be said for this pickup which we'll look at later, but let's turn it around from the other angle and just see the power play that goes on here. So there's Tuisova with his big carry. You can just see the Georgians have never been allowed to get set. The speed of both rucks has just got Georgian defense all over the place. Now you've got the massive threat of Ranrandra. As we said, it doesn't quite work out. It skims across the wet floor. What a pickup, pace, power, strength from Nandolo to finish this off. Not many wingers would have finished this off. Look at the power here to see it off down what a finish so fiji win a scrum penalty here and what i like about this is the ambition you see most of the nations in world rugby would kick the three points here but fiji are playing we've got to love this in the game and now they're getting into their shape into their system and this is really smart play so i'm going to slow this one down a bit they've got a good forward shape you'll see this quite a lot but just to work on the floor it was good tackles from georgia but it's clean ball and that's the key part of all this is clean ball playing on Fiji's terms and now it's really important to manage a game so Fiji aren't really going forward here uh, Georgia are in a strong defensive position but I love the kick through very deliberate first he kicks low but the chasers are ready to put pressure on now they don't score from this but what you're going to see is the accumulation of pressure so Ranrandra puts pressure on you've got Nandolo there Georgia have to clear the lines now Fiji have a the territory they're looking for so Fiji line out, they try a little decoy play, good movement, and they get a little bit of go forward here. Now that's really key in all this. And now you can see how well coached they are. This is very deliberate. It's like they've set up a scrum, the back row with two second rows and a number eight. They're getting three players driving through. Now Georgia repel this pretty well on two occasions, but you can see the coaching coming through. So there's that three-man setup. They're really trying to just chip away, chip away, keep patient. And then their time will come. And again, it's very deliberate. You can see the same setup here. You've got the three-man setup. You've got three bodies against one or maybe two defenders. And then power takes over. Now, if we look at it from a different angle, you can just see how awesome this is. So you've got the ball carrier. And you've got three big bodies against two. And then that's really good play from Fiji. So smart kicking. And then the tactical awareness to break them down and score. And the origin of their next try also comes from a good tactical box kick. So they put the ball up because they're not going anywhere. You've got Nandolo chasing, and that just puts the Georgians under pressure. And then from this scrum, they can launch her attack. So similar to Nandolo's first try, uh, the last one they used to is Sova on the wing. This one, they've got Nandolo, an absolutely massive man. They get him at first receiver, a bit of decoy with Botia, and they're targeting the Georgian 10. No match there. Instantly Fiji are on the front foot. And they're going through the phases now. So you've got the back row coming off and they're hitting it forward. Now the Georgians do do well to slow this down over the next couple of phases. But what you're going to see is really interesting little shape that Fiji are using. So if we just pause it here, you can see this three-man shape. Now this can be used to launch an attack or also reboot slow ball. And that's exactly what they do on this one. Really simple, just to reboot, just to get back into the ascendancy. 
Now you've got Ran Randra, one of the biggest threats in world rugby. He's also good at doing the hard yards. So they're just working in, they're just building back up, trying to reset. And here we go again. And you can see the same setup, but this time it has a real potent attack and launch because the middle man does a rap play with Bola Bola, who started on the inside. So when we play this one through, he started it, and now they've got good variation running lines. And this is a beautiful line, quick play, and this launches the attack. Another quick pick and go. Just keeps Georgians going backwards and now a beautiful pass. Now you've got two or so, one on one. I and mean, then you can see the offload and the fantastic finish. And this play from two or so needs more attention. It's absolutely brilliant. So great pass there, one on one with the 11. Look at all the pressure he's under. Keeps himself alive, keeps the ball alive, and gets a really world class offload and also the support on the inside. But what I like about this, and you can actually see a video I've done on offloading the link is in the top of the corner, is the eye contact, the hands to target, I like to call it shaking hands, and then what a great finish. And here's another example of Volabola's kicking. So this time he goes long, but importantly, he makes sure that it hits ground. So it bounces, remember this is a wet ball, and also you've got an organized chase. A good chase will really make a kick excel. And this is really smart as well. Fiji are organized, they've got two bodies, and then they get really good tackle selection they get their arms under the ball they're targeting the ball because they want to get that more so when we play through Georgia are trying desperately to get down but because of the tackle technique and the selection from the Fijians that means it's a more they're going to get the ball back this is critical for the next setup and the next try so Fiji have got themselves good field position now they can unleash their attack so we've got two Sova going down the wing and you'll notice that nine's in that ruck so Botia steps up he takes control and they relaunch their play. And he also becomes the 12, becomes a 9 the next time here. So really good reading of the play. And what I like about this one is they're finding weak shoulders. So a little tip pass here just finds a weak Georgian shoulder. And it just keeps that go forward. Now you're not going to see many better kicks than this in World Rugby. So just you can see the Georgian wingers starting to close that gap, close the space because of Nandolo, who's a running threat. But Nandolo knows the kick is coming. Volivola puts that kick through, and it is beautiful. And uh, Nandolo uses the water to his advantage. But if we just slow this down, look at Volivola, look across. So he's scanning, he's seeing, he knows Nandolo's going to be chasing. And just look at the contact with the ball. He hits it on the tip of a ball, what sends it down to the grass. He's using the water for it to slide, perfectly weighted. Beautiful finish from Nandolo. Really, really world-class try. So a great set-piece try here. So from line out, they do a little decoy of the mall back to Madavesi who's around the corner. You've got Nandolo standing at first receiver. Common themes, get the wingers in the game. But what's great about this one is how Madhavesi holds the ball up and he gets the Georgian defenders to suck into him. So you can see here he's charging towards the defenders. He gets them on their heels and a beautiful little pass and what a line from Nandolo to slice through the Georgian defence. But it was really well worked. That's not just raw power. That is a really smart play from line out to then the running line from Nandolo but also the beautiful skill from Madhavesi. This was a really complete performance by Fiji. Bearing in mind they haven't played for over a year. Absolutely brilliant. We need more of this in World Rugby. Thanks for watching The Contact Coach.